I just stepped out of the truck here. It could be picked up a little bit. They got some branches that are down and whatnot. We had a pretty good windstorm that come through the other day when we had that weather come through, but a lot of the pastures are shaded, but the fencing's a little bit tired. Proximity of the house to the barns, pretty close. Barn is in pretty good shape. They got rubber mats installed and concrete walkway. Aluminum doors, all the slides look like they're in pretty good shape. They are, they're 10 by 10 stalls. Little tack room here. They've insulated the roof, which I guess is good in some aspects, but we could have done a little cleaner job. Hasn't been cleaned, it needs to be pressure washed and cleaned. I would probably, if it was mine, I would uh, seal the seal the, the ceiling up. Like I said, the barn's in, in pretty good shape. You got another little tack room here. Access outside. Wash rack area on both sides. Barn's not in bad shape, this one. I haven't had a look at this one over here. This has got a metal roof on it. Just a front shed row style barn. Got some place here for some feed. Stalls that go out into paddocks. Got a little bathroom here on the end of this barn. It could be cleaned up. They got some, like some uh, electric wire fence in between some of these paddocks. Of course, we're not a big fan of that. Here's one of the RV hookups. I can see where they got a sewer hookup right here. They got power right there. When they're talking about two RV hookups here, I'm thinking that they're... Uh, Thinking that you would put two RVs here, one here and one here. That power box right there would share to them both, and you'd hook the, the sewer up to both of those. And it's not a bad, wouldn't be bad. One RV there, one RV there. This barn doesn't have a floor in it, shed rows, just gravel. I mean, they're usable stalls. A lot of this back here could be cleaned up. Looks like it's been used pretty hard at one time. They had quite a few horses here. I don't mind the land. Uh, it just needs some, it needs some love and some attention and some of these turnouts they've got. The barn's usable. It could be uh, straightened up, pour a floor in it. Redo some of this. They just got no climb horse fence here that I'm not a fan of, but I'm used to throw bread. So one of those that try to kick their leg through that for sure. But there's a proximity of the other property. Kind of a little breezeway right here. I guess bringing horses in and out. One stall here. They've got one, two, three stalls. Four stalls down that way. They got some more feed here. Looks like they got a washer dryer hookup. They had some rubber mats here at one time. I don't know if they were bathing horses. It looks like they had a cross tie set up. Little tack room. It's in it's in fairly rough shape. The barn could be straightened out. The bones of it's good. I mean it's not bad. Uh, it just needs some love as far as what I would say making it nice.
Not sure what they had over here at one time. Looks like chickens. Just kind of half acidly done. This fence back here is pretty tired. Most of these here are half post. I'm not a fan of half post. I don't give the fence a lot of a lot of value. This is a nice big pasture out in front. It's flat. Could train right in it, set it up, could be dragged and and leveled out a little bit. Replant some grass. It's all pretty, it's fairly congested. I could see that from the, from the pictures online that, you know, these barns are kind of sitting on top of each other. I don't know if that's a big deal or not. I wish it was a little more spread out. I mean, it does make for a lot of the other land that's out there that's usable. But it is a little bit tight quarters in here. I'm going to see that's the well pump house. The roof on the mobile looks like it's pretty tired. I wouldn't give it too long and it's probably going to need to be replaced. Then five years. Let's see if I can find out where the lock is. I'm going to shut it off for a second until I get inside the house. They got a little bit of kind of Got a propane tank there. Got a hot water heater for the house out here. I'm gonna go into the front door. 